Oh. oh. Now we're here. She just spoke Japanese. She's like, oh. I think, Kide Sakura, which means pretty cherry blossoms. I know Japanese. I don't know if that's right at all. <clears throat> oh, dear God. Can, can I be this mother liquor if he talks? Sure. I, okay. Welcome to Kakumura. I was actually looking for some information. Information? Well, you've come to the right guy. Name's Megara. Did you know that I'm no mere station attendant, but a volunteer tour guide on my days off as well? A jack of all trades. I can see from your blank expression that you don't believe me, but I'm in the I'm I'm the best there ever was. I'm not even from around here, and I could still tell you everything there is to know about this place. Guidebooks, maps, the internet, bah, all silly toys for amateurs. I've got it all up here. Right, that's some great. Um, Margaret, is that Japanese? Uh, anyway, uh, what kind of security do you have at the station? Are there many cameras set up around the, the town? Eh, cameras, you say? I guess I should explain, I'm a detective with the Wisconsin Metropolitan Police. Ah, I see. Uh, I'm really less of a current events kind of guy and more of a people and date sort. Some call me the master of time and identity. Did his glasses just blank out? Did I imagine that? That was I, weird. I was looking away. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't look at him anymore. If I had harnessed the, my incredible knowledge and ability to examine the miniature of the events, I could have the greatest the great detective myself. Yeah, I'm sure that's true. Well, okay, maybe He's one... the murderer! He did it! Shoot him! <laughs> He's like, I've worn this red wig! Um, one of a bit more up your alley. Can you tell me about the shrines around here? Maybe someone's off the beaten path? Oh, I know. Just down the street, there's the old shrine, and... and... Yes? The shrine is, um, old and, uh, nice. Go on. Okay, okay, so dates really aren't my thing. But it wasn't fair you caught me unaware with that one. I really am quite knowledgeable. Yep, I believe you. So where's the shrine? <laughs> <laughs> Watch Bang. where you're pointing that thing. <laughs> Jesus. Easy, just up the road and to the right. Oh, <laughs> that way. I meant that way. Sorry, directions really aren't my thing. Oh, I see. What What do you know, then? Um, well, the locals say it has a weird aura to it. See, bet- Oh, yeah, his glasses are doing the thing. <laughs> um, bet you didn't know that. <clears throat> yeah, I'll have to look around myself, thanks. He was helpful. He was a weirdo. And that arm is probably the scariest thing I've- Oh, look! There's the, the toy the cat likes right there. You see it? Can you click it? Oh, oh it oh it's it meowed and disappeared. I bet it's like um an achievement. Ah, uh, is it collectibles? It's collectibles, Wait. my dude. We're playing that. When back. you collect all the cat toys, the cat will come out and scratch the shit out of the red haired girl. <laughs> yeah. Ah Ken saved! Red paint! I guess Ken's hun Ken Ken's uh, hunch was right! But why this house? I'll leave it for now. Forensics may be able to make something out of this. I'll just rub my face right all over that red paint to be to be sure, to be safe and sure. Let's go up there. Shrine gate. The divide between the sacred and us mortals. The shrine it belongs to must be up ahead. Don't call at me. Oh. Don't cacao at me. Don't cacao at me. Oh, what is that? Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Yeah, yeah, whoa. <laughs> I can see something floating in the river that has more red markings on it. I need to carefully fish it out so I don't disturb it. Do I need a f oh, uh, should I fishing pole? Yeah. The shoot break for you. Oh, well, there's nothing around, and it seems to be the fastest way to get myself some bamboo. No, what? What? Why? There's no... Why something? shoot it? You can use your hands. <laughs> <laughs> Is that weird that I saw shoot and I'm like, yup, click? <laughs> 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 Maybe I 
should uh, work Ooh. on that a little bit. That's that's gonna be my my demon to overcome in this let's play. I think <laughs> just not to shoot. Not everybody. to shoot. <laughs> Using the broken bamboo, I can easily push the object out of the water without disturbing it. A train pass, and it looks like, or uh, and uh, just like I thought, it has red paint on it. I should go to the station and see who this belongs to. As a speed run strats. Yeah, speed, speed run, speed run, speed run, speed, speed run. Oh, can I go in here? There's. Oh, I thought there was a thing. No, it's just your clickies. Oh, it's my clickies. It's just your clickies. Just my clickies. I made a mistake being the one to voice this guy. <laughs> Hi! What can the great Margaret help you with? I found this commuter pass by the stream. Can you tell me who it belongs to? Yeah, sure. Just... Is, is that blood? Oh, the red markings? No, it's paint, I think. You think? The blood isn't really my thing. It's definitely not blood. Smell it. Smell? No, no, no need. I believe you. Right, it's not blood handed here. Okay, a little bit got on me, but that's fine. No problem. It's just paint, not blood. Nope, not blood. Deep breaths, Margaret. Right. Sorry about the temporary loss of composure. Allow me to effortlessly find the owner of the pass. Damn thing, I'll just swipe it again here. Ah, let's see. Hmm. Uh, As fortune would have it, I know the owner of this card. It belongs to Mai, the youngest daughter of the Kawa family. A very interesting family indeed. Oh, and what makes them so interesting? Well, they have a lot of land in this area and have donated a considerable amount of... Uh, to the local shrine as well. I often see Mai working there. The house next to the station with the laundry hung up outside actually belongs to her grandmother. Except for Mai, they're all pretty cl cl cloistered a lot. She's usually a very careful girl. I can't see her dropping her pass without coming to see me about it. I know all about those passes after all. I'm the expert, I'm the expert at trade passes! Mai's a good kid! You don't know she's got involved with the fairy types, do you? No, not that I'm aware of. I'm sure it's nothing, but I wouldn't mind talking to her regardless. Well, if she's uh, here, she's probably at her grandmother's. Anything else you'd like to know? That's all for now. Thanks. Thank God. Let's get the fuck. Well. <laughs> all right. So Time now, to shoot the old dusty trail. Time to shoot the door. Look in. No, we won't look in. We'll be polite. There doesn't seem to be anyone home. Okay, now we'll look in. This is a dark room covered in dust. Hard to believe someone actually lives here. Knock again. Still no answer. I guess I'll head towards the shrine. I'm waiting for like a face to appear in the window. Like an old lady face. It's like meh. What was that sound? It sounded like it came from behind me. Oh, is this gonna be spooky? Oh, this is pretty spooky. Excuse the intrusion, I'm with the police. Is anyone here? Hello? Oh, I should... What are you doing? You get in my house. I'm just. I, it feels like a character you were born to play, Piff. Sorry, I didn't mean to startle you. My name's Ito. I'm with the police. Uh, the door was unlocked. You think because you're the police, you let yourself walk around in my house with impunity? I thought I locked that door. Ma'am, do you notice that the screen is flickering very strangely? What do you say your name was? It's not that it matters whoever you are. Get, get, get out of here. I thought you was going around right out the door and knew that you'd locked in where you followed. Followed? No. I'm looking for your granddaughter, Mai, and I wanted to ask her, or ask you, about the red markings outside. Mai, when you know her, she's a good girl. You leave her alone. 
Oh, Last thing I need is some police muff around in my house. When it comes here, I want to be alone and so are my family and I could leave in peace. All I'm doing is drawing unwanted attention. Okay. Now, Piff, I know you don't get any audio from this game. The music's very loud, and I'm going to turn it down. Right. But it's, like, very sinister and, like, right. for the conversation with the old woman. I just want you to, like, okay. s like just simmer on that. On that. Um, okay. Here we go. Besides, I don't care about this super... Oh, the screen went back. <laughs> it's good. Mm. It's back. Can you see it? Uh, there, there it goes. I don't care about these superstitious mockings. Uh, so, so you know what those marks are? There was one some who would made these marks in red so they wouldn't get lost. A guide for those who passed in. To... I'm, a, I'm one of those uh, gold miners. <laughs> Look at that guy. Tarnation! Gee, did you hear that? Why won't get all these time? <laughs> Emiko, Emiko, is that you? No, she's gone. <laughs> <laughs> Why did I call you so? Perhaps you're the one free me from this term, 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 termites. Besides, <laughs> these old bones have suffered long enough. It is what leaves me there then to give you this. This is a trifle Whoa, what piece. the? Give me a minute. What are you talking about? Is it, you're the chosen one. You'll be <laughs> helping me, won't you? Take it from me. It, 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 go. Oh! Should I click it? Oh, am I gonna give it a little kiss? I'm sorry, child. Sorry, what is this? I feel so strange. Years we spent trying to answer that very question, fruit this is. I don't know. I have to get out of here. I'm sorry. Yes, take it away from this place. As soon as <laughs> I touched it, it was as if the lens through which I viewed the world was jarred out of focus. Like someone put a weird screen filter over it like an old-fashioned movie. My vision swirled and sifted. <laughs> my legs became limp and a vile smell assaulted my nostrils. I pushed my way back into the entrance. I needed to get out of that house. Uh, uh, I need to get out. I need to get is out. that a cat? Oh, is that a cat? Oh. Where? Oh. Oh, good job, Piff. Yeah, boy. <laughs> you're gonna be you're gonna be my cat expert, I think, because oh, I'm not the observant type. I'm a hundred percent, hundred and twenty percent not observant. I pick up all them cats. Hmm. Well. Oh, that was fun. The wave of sickness that overcame me began to fade as I emerged from the old musty kawawa house. Immediately, my mind began to write off what I had experienced as a fluke, feelings brought on by my lack of sleep and a strange case. After a few lungfuls of spring air, my headache subsided and my nausea lessened. With every step I took out the door, the strong emotion I felt holding the mask got further away as well. Maybe it was the old cow woman. <laughs> The cow woman. The cow woman who uh, made my mind go to uh, such a strange place. What other explanation could there be? But as I walked away from the house, I stopped and broke into a cold sweat. My skin erupted in goosebumps. Something wasn't right. The mask was still firmly in my grasp. My knuckles had grown white from gripping it so tightly. Why? Why had I held on to it? Before I could think of an answer, I screamed. Oh, a scream from the direction of the shrine broke through the muddled, my muddled thoughts. Piff, can you supply us a scream? We didn't get one in game. <laughs> oh, she hit that. Okay, that's probably the first jump scare people are going to experience <laughs> in this let's play. <laughs> 